Hello everyone. So this is the November Happy Mail haul, which was Christmas and holiday themed. These are cards you guys have made and sent to my P.O. box, which is always in the description box below the video on the Happy Mail videos, as well as on my blog. Forgive my voice, I am getting over a rotten cold. So let's just get to it and get this film before I lose my voice completely. So this one is from Gloria. Such a cute little image, all Christmassy themed. I have a soft spot for owls, of course, and some bling. So that's from Gloria. And then these are from Evelyn in Estonia. She had sent them last month and I made sure not to lose them in the process of waiting for this month. I've said that before, people can send multiple months. Just label them if you can so that I don't misplace things. But yeah, especially those of you sending internationally, I can't, like the shipping costs and that to mail is really expensive. Um, she also stamped the envelopes, really cute. And they're, they're glittery. They're just so adorable. She added little bits to the insides as well. You guys know I love finishing the insides of my cards. And if I can, adding bits to the envelopes, it just gives it that little extra something. So there's shimmer added to that little one too. Super, super cute. So those are those ones. And then these were not Christmas themed, but they were sent to me. I included the package, which is <laughs> obviously empty. This was from Dawn and she said she knows it's not part of the theme, but she saw these and couldn't resist sending them to me. Um, for those that aren't aware, I'm in Canada. We don't get near the crazy things you get in the States, like different flavored M&Ms and all that kind of stuff. Like we don't get any of it. And there is one specialty store in the city that does sometimes get in, especially the flavored M&Ms, but holy wow, are they expensive? So I don't go very often and I've never seen these. So yeah, they didn't last long. I opened them the day I got them. I did share them with my kids. <laughs> they were amazing, so amazing. So I kept the package to remember to say thank you for that. You guys don't need to send these sorts of things, but obviously I'm gonna enjoy it. And then yeah, this really cute um, coffee card. If I asked, how do I take my coffee? I reply seriously, very seriously. <laughs> Love it. Love it. So thank you so much. These were these were awesome and I've, I've never seen them in Canada. So I don't know if we can even get them here at all. So I enjoyed them very much and my kids like them too. So those, that was dues. And this card is from Ben. He says he's 18 years old in South Carolina. So pop these up with dimensionals. He said he colored them with his zigs and then added dimensional dots. So yeah, and then joy from me to you. Super cute, so thank you. Oh, and the envelope I just wanted to include. I love, like even just simple little things like adding like glitter tape to seal the envelope. It just, when you open the mailbox amidst, you know, flyers and bills, it, like having the decorated envelope is always so nice. Okay, so this one is from Laura. She added like, glossy accents to the ornament, the cute little kitty cat image, so cute. So cute. And then we've got a whole bunch of Christmas tags here. So there's some tags and then a couple of cards and then this really cool um, coloring, basically coloring postcard with some foil accents. So really cool. These are all from Met. Is that how you pronounce it? Mette? Met? I don't know. I'm um, in Denmark. <laughs> you guys know I butcher name pronunciation. So yeah, and she said, I think she said gold. How I can't pronounce it, especially with a cold. Um, Gladding Jul. Don't know. It means Merry Christmas anyway. So very cool. Very cool and all sparkling. So really neat and then cute little snowman. So those were from met and then last but not least are some fabulous little cross stitch cards from hope people always love seeing these ones and she's got the little envelopes decorated as well so yeah her fabulous cross stitching which i've talked about in other happy mail haul videos and even d does ones up for the inside how adorable is that so much work, so fabulous. These are just great. So yeah, this one's for the kids. Isn't that so cute? 
I just, I love these. I really do. These are so great. They're so great. So, um, yeah, and I had mentioned it, yeah, I think it would have been October's Happy Mail Haul because we didn't have the, yeah, it, no, September's Happy Mail Haul. Um, we had talked about this because people asked. Um, the Glow in the Dark Floss, she said she gets her Glow in the Dark Floss from Michaels. I don't know, I don't think these ones have the Glow in the Dark. Um, I did look, I'm just saying this now, Hope, we were at Michaels and we looked. Our Michaels doesn't sell it, as far as I know, or maybe they were sold out. I couldn't find any. But I'm going to keep my eye out for it because I think it's really cool. So yeah, for those unaware, you can actually get, like, embroidery floss that glows in the dark. How cool is that? So she had done that on some of the Halloween ones, which I have on display um, in a corner of my room here. So, thank you, Hope. These are fabulous. Thank you to all of you that send things to my P.O. box for the Happy Mail hauls. Um, we, do, we do do themes, but obviously I'm not a huge stickler on them because just by the time things get to me here in Canada and just all the different things, like I'm not gonna exclude someone just because it doesn't meet a theme, obviously. Um, gifts are not necessary at all. Um, I always appreciate them, but you guys don't have to send anything. I just like sharing what you guys have made and people have said they love watching these videos and seeing what others in my little community in the corner of the interwebs, my happy little corner of the interwebs um, are making. And yeah, I love showing these. So I will have the info in the description box below the video on my blog, all that stuff. Thank you all so much for watching and I will be back very soon with another video. Bye!